Welcome to the Monday Night War. I am Luke Owen, D.A.D., representing Monday Night Raw. And I am Chopper P. Quinnell, representing Monday Night Smackdown. We're going to be playing through WWE 2K22's My GM Mode. This video is sponsored by WWE 2K22. Click the link in the video description down below to get your copy today. Available on PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5, Xbox, and PC. Clicking that link not only supports 2K, it supports us here at Parts Fun Known. Thank you so much to those who have clicked the link. We really, really do appreciate it. We appreciate every single one of you. Also, we have been appreciating this game. It's a lot of fun because your boy is number one. Undeservedly so. You reckon? Why? Yeah. Why? Why? Because, why so? Because I... Why so, Pete? I won last why week. Why so, Pete? I won last week. But you didn't win last week. I did win last week. Doesn't say there. Right, but I won. Got more fans, though, didn't I? <laughs> won the week, and I should be number one because I've booked a way better show than your panicked, bad quality matches with your injured stars. Pete, it's not my fault that my show was <laughs> and it And it <laughs> but did better than yours. That's not my fault. I, I should be number one. Okay. <laughs> Right, well, let's go because it is time for me to kick in. Uh, let me get my timer ready. Oh, you're going right now? Okay. I'm going right now, mate. I'm going in for it. I'm, I'm pumped. Okay, ready? Three, two, one, go. Okay. Here we go now. Cincinnati, Ohio. I've got f uh, okay, Triple H. The big pay-per-view is coming up soon. Pay-per-views are the perfect opportunity to have big rivalries conclude. I haven't actually done any. Right, okay, so that's fine. Cool. Uh, I already have a match card in mind. Any advice on what I should be doing? Just make sure you're planning for it. Get some rivalries ready and try not to injure your stars. <laughs> um, I have this free arena power card for you. Use it next week. If you're confident that the show you'll put on be a great one, I'll be watching. Okay. Uh, that loser, Mr. Rally, attacked me uh, last night. I'm not going to stand for garbage like that. I want to sell things in the ring with him uh, within the next three weeks. Well, that's fine, Keith, because it might even be tonight, mate. <laughs> Forget it, Keith. Forget about it, cuz. Sounds good, Keith. Love you, Keith. Small increase. Lovely stuff. Uh, the me you mess with Lee, you pay the price. End conversation. Uh, hey, boss, I've been talking with Brute a lot lately. You had a great idea that we should ta as be... We should team up for a tag team. What? No. Uh, can I convince you to take a chance on us and book an attack match in the next few weeks? Um, yeah, okay. I mean, I've got him for another nine weeks, so yeah, sure, why not? I'm all about pleasing people. A tag team? Um, okay? Okay, here we go. So, special effects, I've got some new stuff. Uh, wonderful, right, high school. I was going to do this in the Capital Wrestling Center. I've got my best, is that the best crew? Oh, that makes it 5% no on that one. Basic lights show quality plus five, optional goal. Book two superstars with two star power, reward book stars with greater than three star power, gain avatar. So you're two yep. star power, yep. reward. I don't know, I have no idea what that means. I'm, just, I'm gonna be honest with you here. I don't really know how this game works. Uh, and now it's throwing a lot of greater than signs and less than signs. And it's talking about star power and it's talking about a lot of stuff that I don't understand even more than how the game actually works. So I have a f blues clue what they're talking about. And I'm going to optional goal. Book one superstar with less than 50 popularity on promos. Reward book superstars with less than three star power. Gain one plus popularity. Okay, well, it's I'll figure that out in a second. Um, Okie dokie, what we got here? Vito Random Superstar. Prevent some random superstar on an opposing show from competing in next week's show. <laughs> yes, please, mate. Confirm. And I'm going to play that right now. <laughs> T he he. Okay, what we got here? Special promotion. Ensures that you retain most of your fans this week. So cost us 75,000. That is pricey. Uh, free arena booking. Any show, any arena show logistic booked this week will be free. Uh, I think I want to do that. When's the pay-per-view? Uh, Phil, do not put Reckoning in a match this week. That's what I was going to do. Ah, 
Ben Guerra worked well as a tag team. Keith Lee. Uh, okay, in progress. Mustafa Ali uh, wants to partner with Brute Force. Um, I didn't see when the next show was. Okay, right, let's just start booking the shows. Um, okay, well, if I do then, do not put Reckoning in a match. Okay, in which case I'm doing one-on-one. -on -one. Uh, Bianca Belair versus Bailey in a normal match. Interference on with Reckoning running in on Bianca Belair. Commissioner Gold met. That is fine because she's not in the match. <laughs> right, mid-card match is going to be one-on-one. Uh, -on -one. It's going to be a tables match and it's going to be Keith Lee versus Mustafa Ali. No interference on that. Uh, and then my main event is Gian Cena versus Egg. Good levels of popularity there. And they're going to have a TLC match with a run in by Randy Orton on John Cena. Cool. And then promo uh, call outs. Um, Alexa Bliss calling out Raquel Gonzalez. Um, and call out Brock Lesnar. Jonas Rojo calling out Brock Lesnar. Chance to begin a rivalry, increase this level. So that's fine. So that will I'll update that. Are they not in a rivalry because of the tag match? Right, okay, well, that might start a rivalry then. That's annoying. Um, cool, 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 cool. Right, so Ali, I'm going to try in a, in another thing. Uh, do, 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 do. Send a chase to Superstar top, top spa to recover 18 more stamina this week. They will be busy this week and be able to do a book for this week's show. Because I was going to do that for... But they won't get injured because they're only doing promos and stuff. So that'll be fine. So power cards, I'm not going to spend that. Um, and I'm not going to do the arena one just yet. Contract negotiation, don't need to do that. Health spa, I do want to do. So we were pretty neck and neck in the ratings there. Ensures that you retain most of your fans this week. Do I want to spend the money and do that? Because it's quite a big thing. Okay, I've still got 40 seconds to make a decision on this. It's going to gain me 1,500 fans by doing the cameo appearances and that. Do I spend big and do it? Because most of the things are like 30 grand or so. It's 75 grand. That'll leave me with about 50 grand. I can see what Pete is doing. I'm gonna do it. And confirm. Oof, God, I hope that does not come back to bite me on the keister. Right. Oh, shit. I am out of money. And I cannot book my show anymore. Uh oh. Oh dear. I don't have any money. What do I do now? What do I do? What do I do in this situation? What do I do? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I, what, you going overtime? Oh, no, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, uh, hold on, hold on. You going overtime, Luke? No, 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 Luke? wait, no, wait, no, wait, no, wait. I'm pretty sure you're going overtime, Luke. Hold on, hold on. Luke, you're going overtime, mate. Hold on, Pete, hold on. Pretty sure you're going overtime, bud. Uh, hold on, hold on. Luke, pretty sure you're going overtime, <laughs> mate. Hold on. Luke, pretty sure you're going overtime. Oh, my God. Hold on, hold on, hold Luke, on. Luke, I'm pretty sure you're going overtime. Hold on. <laughs> Luke, hold on, hold on, sure hold, on hold on, hold on, time. hold on, hold on. What is happening? Hold I on. just want to look slightly to my left to see yeah, what's yeah, happening. No, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm not doing on. it. Hold on. I really want to check this out, and I can't. What's happening, Luke? Were you timing that? How much longer did you go over for? What was all of that about, Luke? Pete, I couldn't afford my show. <laughs> The show cost me like 88 <laughs> grand and I only had 50,000 left. So I ran out of money. So oh it wouldn't God. let me save it. It wouldn't let oh me book the show. God. Luke, I think you might have a problem with money. <laughs> my wife used to tell me that as well. <laughs> oh my God. Mate, that gosh. was bad.
That so, was going really well for a time then, being, and then I panicked on something. We didn't time that because I don't think you pressed it right, but we'll check it in editing how long you were doing that for, and that time gets taken off your next week's booking. Yeah, I, that's fair. That is fair. That's absolutely that's... fair. That is absolutely fair, Pete. I went over time. You did. I went over time, Pete. You I did. know, because I, I did something in the last 40 seconds that it turns out I'd spent too much money. <laughs> you numpty. I didn't, I didn't look at things properly. <laughs> Holy sh! I am not winning this week. There is no way that I'm winning this week. Seven minutes to go. And now. All right. <laughs> uh, Pay-per-view's uh, pay coming up soon. Great. I already have a match card in mind. I actually kind of do. Uh, just be sure. It, yeah, it gets, uh, gets some rivalries trying to injure your stars. Free arena power card for you. Use it next week and be confident the show you put will be a great one. Awesome. Uh, you don't seem to realize this, Quinnell. I don't have a bit of master on the mic. Well, it's a good thing, Shayna, that you're in a promo segment this week. Uh, I want to make a market a promo during tonight's show. Sure thing. I already had you booked in for it, Shayna. Don't you worry. Don't you worry about it. I ain't Shayna saying she's a master of the mic. So you know what? Go ahead, Shayna. Prove to me why you're so good on the mic. Listen, I need to wipe that smoke smile off Lich's face after that loss. I want to fight her again within the next two weeks. Well, it's a good thing you're the main event on this show then, Charlotte, isn't it? Seems reasonable. Is it the main event? It's the main event on this show, I think. Yes. Maybe? I don't know. I need to double check popularities. Exit continues to booking. Okay, right. Got more stuff. All right. Uh, yeah, got this. Book one or... Book one, level two or higher rivalries. I might do that on this show uh cool so we're in the capital wrestling center oh what do we have to purchase here uh stage building crew book three special match types runs or gm interferences i won't do that but show quality plus eight percent plus six percent here uh i don't know if i'm gonna buy it right now i might just save that and just buy this one um and i'm gonna go on this one advanced lights effects and pyro cost 25k um, three superstars. <laughs> no, I'm just gonna leave it. And this one. Thirty-seven and a half thousand for what? Fans getting two and a half thousand though. <sighs> I feel like this is my week to do it. I gotta do it. I gotta do it. I gotta do it. I gotta do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. Oh, I should have done it. But I did it anyway. Barrel campaign. Okay. Book one superstar uh, on promos with less than fifty-five popularity. Uh, I'm not doing that on this show. Sorry, viral campaign. Um, right. So the main is going to be Becky v. Charlotte. Let's double check that. 71 and a 63 versus a 73 and a 57. Yeah, I think. Flesh, uh, Flair versus Lynch. Oh, what's my commissioner goal? Book your least popular available star for a match this week. <laughs> I'm not doing that. Uh, <laughs> so it is going to be Lynch versus Flair. Uh, I think just in a normal, I need to save their stamina, really. Uh, no interference on this one. We'll just book that. Mid card is going to be Slapjack versus Tucker. Uh, I think I'm just going to have a week of just regular ass matches right here. Um, they've got a rivalry going. Their stamina's fine, so I could bump up the rivalry a little bit by doing a tables match. The stamina's still low for that. Um, no interference on this one, I don't think. Yeah. Uh, and the opener is going to be uh, Balor versus Riddle. Yeah, Balor Riddle. Uh, again, a normal match. But there is going to be... What, GM interference? No. I do want to run in, though. Uh, and it's going to be Mace doing a run in to attack Riddle. Cool. Uh, in the promo segments, we want Walter versus Kingston in a call-out promo. Who's got better promo skills? It's Kingston. Kingston calling out Walter. And in this one, we want Storm and Baszler in a call-out promo as well. Yeah. Who's got the better my skills? It's Baszler calling out Storm. Amazing. Fantastic. That's a hell of a show right there. I know it's just normal matches, but I feel like building the rivalries is probably my best course of action right now. 
Uh, I do just want to check the free agents real quick. I don't have that much money to spend, though, unfortunately. So I don't think I'm going to buy anyone here. Because if I was going to buy someone, it would have to be one of the bigger ones. Oh, man. Breeze is only 58,000. In Spirit of Battle of the Brands, I really want to buy Breeze. But I don't think I can justify it. I don't think I can. I'm sorry, Breeze. I really want you. Um... <clears throat> So what is the double cost do? Double the cost of an opposing brand's matches for next week's show. When is the pay-per-view? Free arena booking. Any arena show they just book this week will be free. I'll book that on the pay-per-view. Injury rehab. Reduces injury time for one superstar by one week. No one's injured. Uh, send the chosen superstar to a top spot to recover six more stamina this week. They'll be busy this week and will be unable to be booked for this week's show. Not yet. Depends when your emerging talent starts to become a permanent senior superstar for your brand. No, thank you. Uh, I've got all that done. That's all finished. And I'm fine, right? I'm just I'm just done. Let's confirm this booking right here. So I've got a bit of a, a, a strategic show of this one. I'm, I'm just doing a lot of normal matches, nothing too crazy. I went crazy last week. You can't do that every week, which is what Luke does. You can't do that every week, because otherwise you're going to end up with loads of people having no stamina, right? So it's a little bit of a strategic one, but I think, looking at the popularity of all my guys, I've got some of my biggest views in promo and call-out segments. I've got these great singles matches. Like, this is still going to be a pretty good week for me. I'm going to be I'm going to be really surprised if I don't win this week as well. And we are done with one minute and 20 seconds left on wow. the clock. Hey, you should take your time with your booking, mate. I've taken loads of time, mate. I already had my show planned out in my notebook, ready to go. And I looked at my commissioner girl and I was like, well, I'm not doing that. So I just didn't do it. Oh, wow. Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I just didn't do that. Oh, okay. Yeah. Any reason why? Didn't want to. <laughs> bad commissioner girl. Just didn't want to do it. So I didn't. Chug trouble, <laughs> Yeah. I don't care what you think. Right. Okay. So here's what happened, Pete. Is so. With, with about 40 seconds to go, mm. there was a power card. Mm. And I was like, oh, I could get that because I've got the money for it. Mm -hmm. and so I bought it. 75 grand. I was like, I can get that, I'm gonna play it now. Ooh. And it was only then when I re and I was like, I was like, oh I've got the money. Mm. And it was like, I didn't see the show budget yeah, thing yeah, yeah. underneath it. Ugh. And then obviously like the show budget the show budget was like eighty-eight grand and mm. I only had like fifty-one left. Oh, <laughs> so I had to like remove all of my special matches and stuff. Of course you don't have to say right now, but also, what does that power card do? If you've already played it, do you mind saying what it does? It was about retaining fans. Oh, I see. So you don't like, so I don't lose as many fans mm. this week. Mm -hmm. Okay. So good to know. Maybe that actually helped me out here. But I've got maybe. an opener: Bianca Belair versus Bailey. Okay. Uh, with a run in from Reckoning because she's being a bit of a thorn <laughs> that, in her that's side. That's her thing. It's her. It's her thing. She's she's a bit of a wild one. Run in Reckoning. That's run in her reckoning. name. I mean, it didn't help though. You know, Bianca Belair still got the win there. Two star opener. R rival. The rivalry grows. The rivalry grows. The rivalry grows. The rivalry grows. Reckoning and Belair. That's the the feud you want to. That's the one I want up. Yeah, that's one I want. Yeah, good. That's good. So this was supposed to be Alexa Bliss calling out Raquel. Okay. But I couldn't afford that. <laughs> <laughs> so it's just Alexa Bliss doing a promo. Hey, it, I, her it, stamina's it, it, it rests Whoa. her a little bit. Also, that is an excellent promo from Bliss. That'll do me. Six popularity up. Her not promos bad. are wicked. Mm. Yeah, that Seems is not so. quite what I was after. This was supposed to be a tables match because uh -huh. I got told that he's dead good in tables matches. But you couldn't afford that. I got an email from Mustafa Ali mm. saying, um, I've been talking with Brute Force. <laughs> <laughs> we yeah. think we'd yes. be an amazing tag team. Oh my God. <laughs> and I'm like, um, okay. Right. Yeah, okay, cool. Oh, but I've said that I'll do it now, so okay. I've got to do that at some point. All right, yeah. So... Keith Lee really wanted this match, so this will mm -hmm. please him. Oh, Ali gets, Ali gets the win. win! Three star! Wow! Card match. Damn it, that's better than my it's opener. better than your opener. Piss. <laughs> of course it's going to be better than my opener. It's a giant versus a cruiser. Sure is. Cock it. Um, so, yeah, this is just resting again. Uh, mm -hmm. Samoa Joe there. Makes sense. Weary, weary guy. An excellent, excellent promo. promo. Rivalry grows there as well. Level Delightful one to level two. stuff. And then Whoa. I've got Cena versus Orton. Sorry, Cena versus Edge. It was going to be a TLC match, but I couldn't mm -hmm. afford it. Yep. Uh, with a run in by Randy. Randall. Orton. So All here right. we go. Stimulate. Big stars. Edge, Edge gets, the, gets win. the win because of the run in. Ooh. That's a one and a half star main event. Disappointing. Oh. 
Oh dear. Ooh. How did Cena versus Edge have a bad match? They had nothing but good matches 15 years ago. Edge versus Cena, who had banger after banger for like, I don't know, five years or whatever it was, and they main evented every single f pay per view. Pull out a one and a half star match in my main event. The f guys? Come on! You're supposed to be better. It's a really big match, John, you knob. Do better. But hey, you got your rivalry level two. No, but for I mean, do you, well, do you know what? That is, that, that was my, that's what I wanted. Out of yeah. It. So okay. Again, in a way, mm -hmm. yeah, I'll take that as a victory. Let's have a look at SmackDown. Here we go. Where we got uh, the opener of Balor versus Riddle oh, with a mace run. With a mace run in on Riddle as well, because technically is this for in that um, tag feud. Is this for base? Is the tag feud? That's the, that's base. Yeah, that's the that's the tag team. Yeah, not Maller. Not Maller, and not face. <laughs> Anyway, <laughs> uh, Balor versus Riddle is the opener. Uh -huh. This yeah, might yeah. be a bit of fun. Bit of you know? fun, bit of just solid a, match. Just a normal match. Two star Balor match, I reckon. Win. Probably a yeah. solid two star. Two star. That's, that's, that's what you need. It's, it's fine. It's fine. Not quite what you want for an opener. It's fine. I was hoping it would have been a bit better. It also yeah. furthered no rivalries. That's not what I wanted. I, I, I wanted Balor versus Riddle to, to feud more. I guess the run in interfered with that. I don't well, know no, how this I game did, works. Well, I did that because the Orton one furthered the feud between Orton and Cena. Yeah. Well, between Orton and Cena. Yeah. That makes sense because it was a run-in, but I want Balor and Riddle to continue the feud. But oh, I think Mates doing the, the run-in run might have interfered oh. with Balor and Riddle. Oh, dear. Mm. Oh, so you think now the feud is between Mace and Riddle? Uh, kind of. It's just not further than what I wanted. Anyway. Anywho, that's fine. Calling Shayna out Baszler, here. Tony Storm just rested him up a little bit before the pay-per-view. Smart, smart thinking. Um, and also, Shayna Baszler specifically told me, I don't think you understand. I'm a master on the mic. Put me in a promo tonight. And I was like, I already had you planned for a promo. So that works fine. Works out well. Yeah. So a call-up promo with Baszler. It was an okay... <laughs> Shayna, you know when you say you're a master on the mic? <laughs> I think she you lied to you, Pete. You really need to back that up, you know? So, but hey, the rivalry grows. What we've so. had here is a a mediocre opening. Yes. And then an okay promo. That this is, is correct. SmackDown is fine. It's fine. It's totally fine. I knew it, Shayna. You're not a master of the mic. I'm a master on the mic. You're nothing. Why are you on this? Oh, yeah, you're my champion. No, sorry. Yeah, no. You're great, Shayna. You're great. Love you. You're great. Perfect. Good job out there. It was an okay promo. After Good. that, we've yep. got Slapjack, oh! Slapjack versus Tucker. The big blow-off match that we wanted. Big time tables match. Mm -hmm. You love to see this. In match. your mid? In the mid. I did I did not think this would do as well as Balor vs. Riddle. Looking at the popularities overall, I was like, I, I think Balor vs. Riddle is a bigger draw. So you think this might be a one and a half star match? Oh, it's <laughs> going to be better than my opener, isn't it? Let's stimulate it. It's hey! Tucker! Big Tuck. Two and a half star. Rivalry, yeah. the, the, the rivalry rose. The rivalry rose once again. I genuinely think it's that run-in from Mace that screwed me over. Because I think if I didn't have that run-in, the opener actually would have been better. Mm. I think. Mm. Yeah. We're learning. We're learning on the job. All right. There you, go. there you go. And then we've got some nice Kofi calling out Walt here. Rivalry three out of four, mate. And... Kofi is uh, an amazing promo, supposedly. Mm -hmm. So fingers crossed, this is a great promo segment and resting them up before the pay-per-view as yep, well. Yeah, smart. Is it the pay-per-view next week? I don't know. An okay promo? <laughs> Come on, Kofi! <laughs> Work with me here, man. It's all right, the growth will re-rose. The will re -rose. It's okay. Anyway, main event, Charlotte versus Becky. Just a straight singles. Straight singles. That's all you need. Stimulate it. See what's going on. See what happens. Great main event match between these two. They're both amazing. Charlotte gets the win. It's a three-star main event. And a good, good, good main event. Okay. You'd expect better from them. You would expect better from them, but you know, it's just a normal match. No extra stuff going in. The rivalry didn't further for some reason. I feel like I'm doing everything <laughs> right, you know? Smackdown is a oh, nothing no. happening show. Oh, mate, look at that. It's all over. Woof. Poor, Poor finale. finale. Your main event was overshadowed by a more entertaining mid-card, leaving fans disappointed at the end. Swapping these two matches would have created a more satisfying finish for your show. Well, I would have thought... Mm. I would have thought that Cena or... Cena Edge would have been bigger than Lee mm -hmm. Ali, just yeah. based on their popularity and stuff. Well, but shows you. Shows me. I was mm. absolutely wrong. You know? Poor opening. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Mid caught up from the opener is show, creating a weak start and confusing pacing. <sighs> Swapping these two matches, but yeah, 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 yeah. All right, yeah, yeah. all right. Was, Again, I no. thought Battle and Riddle would have done better than Slapjack and Tucker. But, not, know. not, not a good week for for either of us. I it's think. Not, it's not a good week, and you know, I thought I, I thought I was going to be okay. Can I flip this back one? to mine yeah, for a second? Yeah, yeah. Because what have I got here? So that's level two now, mm -hmm. and nothing else. Is that nothing it? Nothing else happened on your show. I thought that rivalry road. I don't know. I don't know. Oh, mate. Mate? Oh, that's not what I wanted. Yeah, yours is... Oh, I got Slapjack and Tucker and uh, Warwick Kingston and Baser and Storm. I know, but like... Oh, tits. So that's good. That's all, all set right, up Okay, nicely. here we go. So that's fine. So another 77,000. 77, Let's call it 78. Yeah. Uh, made some money there. Nice. That's good to 65 see. 65 grand profit. Not yeah, bad. Not bad at all. Here we go. Holy crap. Reckoning just blindsided Bianca Belair again. Mm -hmm. Boring show, Raw. Oof. Oof. Yeah, f*** <laughs> off, Dark. Follower 94. <laughs> Amazing. Mr. Safari Lee versus Lee was so good. The Raw main event didn't compare. Should have put that match last on the card. I know that now. New Age Artist, oh, 86. Queen Man Universe coming in with a great point. I don't know how I feel about Johnson versus Edge. I didn't know who to... Oh, because they're face versus face. Didn't know who to root for. Oh, of course. Wah, wah. Wah. Oh. Oops. Whoopsie poopsie. Whoops. Should have done Orton versus Edge. Mm, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Alexa getting pushed a lot on Raw lately. Too right she is. Um, try repeating those words to my face next week. Samoa. <laughs> <laughs> Brackets general. The Isle of Samoa. Try saying that to my face next I week. they put his first name as Samoa. Ah, oh, brilliant. Not Joe. Not Joe. <laughs> That's his but... son. <laughs> no, please. My friends, my father is Mr. Joe. <laughs> Call me Samoa. <laughs> Don't know what Raw was thinking about that opening match. Maybe more people could have stuck around if they started with Lee versus Ali. Mm. Yeah, all right. Well, that <laughs> over there said it should have been the main event. So it looks like you don't actually know what you want. Joe called out Brock Lesnar tonight. Knocked out at the park. Great performance. Bianca yep. Belair getting even with Bailey tonight. Uh, respect where it's due. Good match, Hedge. I don't think it was, John. Not going by. Well, let's see. Oh, man. Well, what do you, do you reckon I still won? I think you might have, because my show wasn't great either. Yeah, and I played that power card that retained me fans. Mm, that's true. So yes, so last week's fans were. Wait, you spent 75k on that and still made 65 grand profit. Oh yeah. Whew. Yeah, yeah. So Wild. stars, mate. So free crew booking for yeah. a week for my commissioner's goal, and he's still number one, baby. You love to see that. No, you don't. Yes, you do. No, you don't. The fans love it, Pete. No. Because Raw's the scrappy underdog here. How? <laughs> How is it the scrappy underdog? Because I lost the week one. Of course I didn't f win this week. Oh, sh I won again. Go me. Here we go. All right, 70, 70, you, you drew 70, less, fans, less fans than me, almost 10,000. And you only made 31,000 off the back of that, which means, I mean, you've still got like 100 grand more than I have. But... Did you see? Did you guys see Mace Jump Riddle? Totally uncalled for. So I think that fan retention's really helped you. I think it really week, has. Because now you got seven thousand fans more than me on that week. That's kind of wild. With a one and a half star main event. Thanks, fans. Kind of wild. Yeah, well, they might not turn back in next week after that <laughs> show. Uh, can't wait for Balor to get a shot at the title. My favorite superstar on SmackDown. Yeah. Maybe he might after the pay per view. We'll mm. see. He might need to turn face first though. Not my greatest fight tonight. I have to hand over Charlotte Flair for taking full advantage. Uh, Charlotte Flair making hashtag SmackDown look good with the win tonight. Becky Lynch never stood a chance in bringing the dominance to SmackDown. Can't SmackDown give us a bit more variety? Let's see some superstars with different classes. Yeah, I got a lot of specialists, you haven't did, I? You did, and you were bragging about yeah. that back in the draft day. We're like, look how many, oh, look how many specialists I've booked on me show. I have got six faces, mm -hmm. six heels, six men, yeah. six women, uh -huh. six specialists. Wow. Well, turns out that... Is it? Glorious Underground 93 thinks otherwise. <laughs> Charlotte Flair settles the score with Becky, thinks eating up between them. No loss between Tucker and Slapjack. <laughs> Rivalry really eating up! Yes, tap out Hillbilly Universe! There is no love lost between Tucker and Slapjack uh, in all caps. Tony Silves is trying repeating those words to my face next week, Shayna, which she did. It was a call out promo this week. Mm. She did say it to your face, Tony. 
but that's fine. Tony Storm was called out by Shayna Baszler tonight. Looking forward to seeing them sell things in the oh, ring. Makes it look like Tony wasn't actually at the show. <sighs> yeah, look at that. Ranking number two, Pete. Whoa, ho, ho, look at this guy. 10,000 10, fans just ahead. Under, just under 10,000 fans. And like last week you were like, I don't know, two underneath me. And now a big old 10,000 fans more as we head towards the pay-per-view. You know what though? I think at the pay-per-view, I'm going to demolish you. I mean, you actually have some feuds and I've got diddly dick going on at the mm -hmm. moment. Yeah. I've also got some plans. Oh. Got some plans for the pay per view, Luke. Maybe you know. Yeah. So I think I'm just gonna kill it. Well, gonna kill you. Right. <laughs> All right. <laughs> it's only a game, mate. In real life. <laughs> I'm just gonna straight up murder you. <laughs> Pete, I think that's gonna do it for this week's edition of the Monday Night War, with me being the victor again. But next week is the pay-per-view, so maybe you can try and claw it back there. Fingers crossed. Just maybe, because it is WrestleMania Backlash next week. So please do check back next Monday for the next episode of the Monday Night War. This series is sponsored by WWE 2K22, and you can get your copy of the game by clicking the link in the description. It's available on PS4, PS5, Xbox, and PC. Picking up a copy of the game not only helps 2K, as you also get a copy of the game, but it helps us out at Parts Fun Known. So if you want to help support us, click that link. We're also having a lot of fun playing it. I've been very mm. much enjoying playing through my GM modes. It is a bunch of fun. Really enjoying this. But also, I'd really need to win, and then I'll enjoy it a bit more. <laughs> That's all we've got time for on this edition of the show. We'll see you next Next week, jam that jam. Uh -huh.